confused when I realized that there was these two opposing forces going on right here. There was this kid right here who said this. What do you mean by that? I'm not sure. Because everybody has the same feelings in certain songs of percent. Just because you said them first doesn't mean that you have, you know, a title on the plot. And this guy. understand that the music is not free. A song is a product. A song is just like the man who makes donuts. Okay, so it's, it's a donut or it's free. Okay, so my film was trying to figure out what's in between these two opposing views. And now I always wanted to make this film an open source film. And what that meant for me at the time was that I was going to put all the footage that I shot, including this stuff, up on a website and I would invite people to remix it and, and that those remixes would be included in the film. I'm mean, going to date myself a little bit by saying that when I first came out with this idea, the Web 2.0 didn't exist. The tools that to make this happen weren't there. But now they're starting to, to be there. With things like Flickr and YouTube and MySpace, I can actually start to get some of this material that I'm looking for remixed, but also um, original footage uh, submitted. So the two uh, main characters at the moment for the film are... Um, there's a DJ named Girl Talk. Anybody know Girl Talk? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right on. Q has got him on his collect collectic uh, list. Yeah. Um, and the other guy who you're probably familiar with is Lawrence Lessing. Um, so I'm going to show Woo! a clip from uh, Girl Talk, which has uh, some of the kind of open source elements in it, footage that was submitted through the site uh, by people. Mm -hmm. 